Hi, I'm KP. Hi, I'm Ariel. I'm Sasha. And you're watching. Uh, I don't know what, if you guys we, know where you what are. are we watching? Nerd, dirt? nerd dirt. Yeah, yeah. Nerd, nerd, nerd dirt. Yeah, nerd dirt. I just wanted to see if it's like. No. No. <laughs> I, I'll just, I'll just like black band over here. Okay. Well, anyway. <laughs> anyway. Speaking of black, no, <laughs> it doesn't transition well. We're not well. gonna speak on any of that shit. <laughs> I mean, I mean, I mean, but, we could though. I mean, <laughs> the only black band I know is like the 18 van. The what? The 18. Never mind. That ages me. Anyway, <laughs> hi guys. We're gonna be talking today about um, cosplay. 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 One of the most, one of the sexiest, and also most gentrified. Uh, see, okay, so is. okay, see, hold on, wait, okay, it's only for see, rich people. But okay, hold on, wait. <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of why I wanted to talk you about it. What? Uh, wrong. So oh. cosplay definitely has been around for quite a, quite a while. Yeah. Cosplay, yeah. like the term cosplay, um, yeah. comes heavily from like comic community. Yeah. Um, and and a lot actually from like Japanimation anime community as well too, especially yeah. with the uh, conventions and everything. Oh my god, yeah. Um, you guys are here today because definitely wanted to get your guys' takes on it. You already spoke a little bit, and of course I'll talk about my take as well too yeah. and my experience yeah, with sure. it. Oh. And. Hopefully this helps someone who's either interested in cosplay, yeah. or at least likes to see yeah. them, or... I mean, if you're interested, definitely save up your money. Like, it's called yeah. cosplay for a reason, because it costs to play. Okay? It does cost <laughs> to play. Just keep that in mind. <laughs> it costs a lot <laughs> to play. So, so... Uh, so, er, we'll, we'll start with you. What's your... Um, I mean, I definitely... Well, I mean, my whole thing with cosplay is I like it. I feel like the community tends to be, like, either the best people ever, or mm -hmm. the most douchiest. <laughs> Cause like there's a lot of fat shaming, a lot of race shaming, a lot, any type of kink shaming. Like I mean, like I like the community like in theory. Yeah. But I hate it in practice. Like communism, you know. Like I'm all for it, but it's also <laughs> like eh, from what I've seen it done, it's like just just know where you're hanging out with. Definitely, if yes. you're gonna cosplay, I recommend doing it with friends. It's your first time. Like do like a Teen Titans cosplay or. A, one piece one yeah, cosplay. like those those group cosplays, and I see a lot within like the cosplay community. Yeah. A lot of them tend to to um, to do their best in groups, yeah, for or sure. I guess oh. like, guilds. Oh I think they call them guilds. Guilds. <laughs> guilds. Like the thing that That's fish a, have. No, no, but, no. <laughs> <laughs> yes. No. Sometimes. It, okay. Anyway, it's cosplay. We're sometimes we're only talking yes. about aquatic os yeah, cosplay. Aquatic now. cosplay. <laughs> like yeah. Anyway, but uh, what's your um. Any kind of memories or... Yeah, well, I mean, like, overall, like, cosplay, I feel, is there to kind of, like, makes people feel things. Like, make, make people feel happiness, excitement, mm -hmm. like, things like that. Yeah. Um, going off of the whole group cosplay thing, I think the best cosplay I've ever seen is it was a group of guys, and they were pretty much just no shirts, only, like, socks, shoes, and then a box, like a painted box around them, and then all of the different toad colors... <laughs> like so, they were all like from Mario Kart. Like they made cheap little ah, Oh, Mario I think I've Kart seen cars. this one. That is awesome. Dude, they, and you know, and it didn't even cost that much. Like it was just oh, it made everybody get, in the room excited. The minimalistic <laughs> cosplay. No, I've seen the yeah. same one except like those guys had like um um what you call it spanks on. Oh, wow. And then they were the colors of the EV evolutions. Oh that's my actually, god. Yeah, that's actually kind of you know. Okay, actually, you know, I, I will admit if you can do like cosplay like cheaply, like that's actually more impressive to me than the big cosplays. Yeah. Because like the big cosplay, that's just all that shows me is that like you know you're probably like a computer scientist or an engineer. <laughs> all that shows that you, you, you got, got money. Some, all that shows me that I've all, seen yeah. whole like Iron Man yes. like stuff. Yeah. Oh my god, dude! I, I saw a, like we went to uh, Long Beach Comic Con and yeah. you see right here, yeah, right there, Long Beach Comic Con. <laughs> um. Uh, and uh, yeah, we went to one and I saw a full-on war machine. Yeah, like with the yes. the turn and everything. Yes. Like, the heck? No, dude, I, I saw a whole like when I was in Anime Expo. Yeah, like down in like Staples Center, I saw like a whole mobile suit Gundam, like an actual like yes. this thing had like the actual it flared out and everything. I was like, dude, you know like, that person stank in there, like for oh, sure. No, like, no, they no, definitely no, 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 like... definitely. I, I kind of <laughs> wanted to follow them just to see them like take off and be like. Ah! They just take it off and it looks like they removed a fishbowl yeah. on their head. It's just water it's just, now. Oh just God. steam yeah, coming out. Steam and like, 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 I gotta give credit to whenever I see like the female cosplays, the one they're like skimpy bikinis and shit. That looks so much more That's comfortable. The wave, honestly. That looks so much more comfortable yeah, to me but, than like a fucking giant mech suit. But I also feel like, well, I mean, getting to like kind of my, like what I see in cosplay, I think oh. like, I feel like you have a more sense of like modern cosplay because a lot of modern cosplay is just like Sex. it's very emotion yeah it's very emotional oh, yeah. very yeah. minimalistic yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, okay look all i'm saying is is like I'll, I'll repeat myself yeah what i'm saying is the same way i expect white rappers to acknowledge grandmaster flash and the you no know, the, the makers before them 
I want hot people to acknowledge the ugly people yes. who made the culture I actually for agree them. With you. And this you is know? why I agree with you. A hot person okay, look, did not make all those great videos. This games. is why I freaking agree with you. Because especially in cosplay. No, hey. Yeah, no, yeah. Especially in cosplay. Look, yes. I've been I've been doing cosplay photography since like nice. freaking 2008 maybe. Yeah, yeah that's a good. Oh yeah, that's like amazing. not not all of it's good. Uh, I just did it because it was a really cool hobby, and yeah. it was one of the biggest appreciations for me. In terms of like taking pictures of people who yeah. spent time, spent yes. energy, spent money, yes. as you say, spent money, yes. spent money, a lot of money, spent money, a lot, spent money lot. on this stuff. <laughs> like they spent like I, I used to, I used to know cosplayers that that would uh, weave their own chainmail. Wow, yeah, like I mean, freaking I've seen that for a. That, that, that yeah, shit. I was like, what the fudge? Like Dude. you are so de so dedicated. Yeah. And then now you got freaking like nerd girls on freaking Twitch. Like they'll just wear oh, a tank top. A, that's the same stop. color as a video oh, game. Oh, oh, bro, and it's and they call it cosplay. And I'm like, oh. it's not really cosplay, but and I I have the same. It's like appreciate the people who work hard. Yes. To to basically like and and that was the biggest culture that I loved about cosplay back in the day when I was taking photos. Yeah. Is that you saw people like they may not have had like the actual like body, body for type. it, yeah, of but oh, like they definitely. actually oh, tried. They definitely... Some people actually worked out trying to fit in their own costume just to look mm -hmm. just yeah. close to yeah. the anime that they it's really love. It's a fantasy. Yeah, like it's a fan. I don't yeah. think it's a fantasy. But when you have hot people who look like when you just have hot it, people bringing their freaking yeah. like like camera people yeah. who have like fifty thousand dollar cameras yeah. to a freaking cosplay event. Yeah, like I'm not. It gets tiring. Like I'm yeah. not. I'm not hot shaming the ones that do it. Again, like I understand that not every. I understand I'm there are some just... ugly ducklings, and you know, like some people weren't always hot. You know, yeah. Real. I understand. You know, you could. You, <laughs> I, I know what a gym membership looks like, but <laughs> but for the most part, it was like yeah, like there was some sincerity to it when it first started out. It was like yo, like I may not look like if like for example, I know there's a huge riff with like black people doing cosplay because it's like there aren't. There's very little black people in anime. And there's very little. We got maybe like the Boondocks, and that's not even really an anime, <laughs> but it's yeah. close to it. Like there aren't much, <laughs> but like there was still that sincerity of like you know I, I still want to be this character. I still want to be in this fantasy, right? You know? And, and the, like, I like that. That's what yeah, I want. Yeah, and I, I I I really like, and I'll even say I miss that type of culture. Yeah. Because you don't see it as much yeah. anymore. Because everyone just like. I gotta do this. I gotta do this cosplay because I gotta get views on Instagram. Yeah. I gotta get my followers and everything. Yeah. And it gets so hyped up in, in yeah. the social media part of it that you forget that like some of these people just go because like I really like this character. Yeah. Instead, they're just like, well, what's the SEO? What's the what's the optimized Google search? And yes. that's the one I'm gonna do. Do you remember like the freaking like the Bowsettes that came out? What? So Bowsette was just wait, like. Wait, wait, wait. Do you know about Do you this? Do you know Bowsette? Yeah. Oh, so yeah. Bowsette was just like, I don't know they, so, so like really hot girls like created uh, Bowsette from this theory mm -hmm. that's, um, that you know how like, like there's a female toad, but then there's like a mushroom and female toad, when it gets the mushroom, it becomes toadette. So she looked, so female, female toad looks like Princess Peach. So it's like, well, what would Bowser look like if he ate the same mushroom? And it's like this really hot looking Princess Peach, but in like a oh, Bowser outfit. Oh, man. So instead of a dress, it was like freaking that like actually, a skin type. That bikini. actually kind of, actually, I could do that actually would make more like, yeah. what is it? Uh, fuck, how, how can I phrase this? And rule, it wasn't, yeah. Rule 34 material. Yes. Because, like, no, because it wasn't a real thing. No, it wasn't. Everyone started well, dressing well, like this thing. Just that. Because it's just, it got not viewed. Not even just that. It's like everyone loves a bad girl. You know, everyone loves yeah. a bad boy. Bad, like, yeah. no, because like our generation wants to fuck Satan. Like, just straight up. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, fuck God. Like, God's the father, but Satan's daddy. You know what I'm saying? There's a lot going on. There's a lot. Awesome. No, I'm just saying, like, <laughs> yeah. it's like, it's like nobody wants the good girl. Yeah. People want Bowser. Like, that. it makes sense. Like, you know. Yeah. I, I get don't know. That. I, I definitely yeah, understand what's your view on the, this? Yeah. The, the plight against hot people in yeah. geek culture in general. Oh, but oh, also, yeah. like, yeah. if the someone plight. took away Jessica Negri from me, I'd be very upset. Like, she's so, still, see, I don't think, she's still I think she, she, I'm just saying, there she, are people who deserve respect. And, like, I mean, at the end of the day, like, I'm just not into body shaming. I'll give her credit. I'll give her credit. Like, I'll give Jessica Negri. Negri. Ne ne what? Negri. Negri. Oh, hold on, man. Calm down. Dude. <laughs> That's her name, man. I'm not saying what okay. you think I'm saying. All right. No, but I'll give her credit because she was one of the first, like, people I saw who did cosplay and was hot, but genuinely... She actually spent money on plastic surgery. She spent money on, like, just hey, to she's look... She's on Pornhub. She's on Pornhub? All right, guys. I gotta go. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's, let's, let's wrap it up with this. Um... Favorite memory about cosplay, like maybe your favorite cosplay that you've seen, or maybe you've done, I don't know. Right. I don't know if you've done any. I, um, I think one of my favorite memories would have to be like when I saw the girl who did um, Ed and then actually brought her corgi for like Heinz. So like that, because okay, so this was like my first anime expo ever, 
and I, I wasn't really, I was really new to everything, yeah. and I've always been a huge Cowboy Bebop fan, and yeah. then all of a sudden this girl yeah. is doing, actually doing handstands and walking on her hands and everything, and then I was like, oh, no way, and then her corgi comes up, and I'm like, no oh. way! Like, it just turned into, like, a big thing of it. That's why I think, like, so cosplay is meant to, like, invoke excitement and, yeah. like, just really bring out your love for, like, anime mm. and geek culture in general. Yeah. But, yeah, that was probably my favorite memory was, like, seeing the actual corgi, and I was like... He's naked. He's not even in cosplay, but he's. But a he's in cosplay. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> it works, it works, yeah. It works. All right, yours. Um, so one of my favorite things is I really love uh, Anime Expo season, like around here in like LA, mm -hmm. um, and I love more so like after the expo is kind of over, you can just walk around downtown LA, and like normally downtown LA is like Gotham City, but like when it comes <laughs> to like cosplay and like Anime Expo, that whole weekend it's like you have just a bunch of like. Hatsune Miku's walking around. It feels like you're in like, it almost feels like yeah. you're not even in LA anymore. Cause you'll just yeah. be like, cause everybody's fucking starving at like midnight. So you'll just be like walking around and you'll out of nowhere, you'll see like Inuyasha in a corner, like making out with like Hatsune Miku. You'll see like fucking Ash Ketchum with like some fucking shit happening, like dealing drugs. Like you'll see just a bunch of like, no, I have, I have that's genuine, not, yeah. I have memories yeah, of like walking to the pantry, which is like this place called the pantry, a block away from anime school. And just like seeing a bunch of just like fucking nerds, like just all of us in unison, <laughs> mm -hmm. kind of just like eating like fucking just like late night diner food and like that's a vibe to me because oh, it's almost dope. it's almost like you kind of wish that this was accepted everywhere you know that you could just cosplay every day any given moment but you can only do that on that weekend so it was just cool just walking around at night and just seeing all the cool shit that happened that's my favorite it's the I acceptance remember. and i really like that's that. yeah that's the thing i liked about it i just like i just wish that cosplay you could do that anytime and not just during like festival season yeah <laughs> yeah so mine is um uh it, it's really spent so i was taking pictures at one time uh, at Anime Expo, yeah. and then I saw this couple it's who vibe. it's um, so there's a there was a there was a guy and girl, yeah. uh, but the guy was like he was like four eight four nine, really, and then the girl was like maybe five six five seven. Yeah, right? I got that guy's my hero, but <laughs> but the guy so the guy dressed like Krillin. Oh and shit! And the girl dressed like Android eighteen, yeah. and she had oh. genuine blonde hair, and they were like and. Like they were both white, but Android was yes, like white. Okay, okay, but then yeah. he also had like the dots on his head, and that he shaved his so head. Cool. He committed to the entire role, that is so it was so... like real life Krillin, and like that's Android actually... eighteen, as if they were real couple. Like because that's... they were a real couple. No, they were... That's actually really. And it was so dope. cute, oh. and I was like, <laughs> God dude, and it's like this is what I love. Dude, like, you just kind ah. of embraced like what your what 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 your what what who who you guys were yeah, as a couple, exactly. and then you actually found an anime that you're just like. Help yeah. you guys relate that to actually means a lot. I know to a lot of people when you can find an anime that you can like sort of like you know you guys can cosplay. Like, there's yeah. a couple. I, I, I respect. Yeah, that's just, that's adorable yeah. that they found that. It's right. important that you find that anime. So we do have to wrap it up. What? Uh, but oh, if you have a cosplayer that you really love, just let us know in the comments, and then we'll look look it up. Or if you have a cosplayer that you really love and want to support, let us know this also. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Um. My name is KP. My name is Ariel. I'm Sasha. And you've been watching nerd, 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 don't, nerd. Don't, don't the dirtiest of nerds. Please don't fat shame. The dirtiest, the, the dirtiest. dirtiest. The, that, that was Sasha who dirtiest. said that. The dirtiest. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Don't, don't fat shame, but definitely, uh, what is it? Uh, king shame. Don't do that either. Don't do, yo, yo, yo. <laughs> some people gotta be shamed. They gotta be. Yo, you ever heard of a foot fetish? All right, so the. <laughs> you ever heard of that? <laughs> that shit. Uh, you keep that shit inside. Fat Sailor Moon. We good. Oh, that's. What's the? That's not nerd. That's not nerd. Fat Sailor Moon.